In some causes or in causes in the past, you had the, the chance to put a plate on a plastic bone or to do the approaches on a non-fractured anatomic um, region. But now you have the chance to plan exactly your approach, the position of the patient, the fixation of the fracture, the reduction of the fracture. So it's really a great um, concept and you have the chance to exercise multiple steps of a fracture treatment, which is not possible in other settings. He doesn't have to tell, I would, I should, I could. He has to do it. He can show it. So it's a beautiful teaching and coaching tool. I could imagine to put it also in the examination. And additionally, and this is, this is tremendous, they provide you with a printed 3D model of that dedicated fracture type. And then you have the unique opportunity to perform a surgery like you will do it in the OR in the future. To really go to the last tips and tricks that you can give um, for fine adaption of difficult situations, this is excellent with this kind of uh, fractures and specimens. And even I, who is doing it many years now, I really sometimes profit from other um, people being on the table, being from abroad. I mean, sometimes it's interesting to see how similar their thinking is, but sometimes you learn something new. The, the benefit is first the patient, because he has not the trainee who does it the first time on the patient. Also for the industry, where a lot of people of um, from the industry can take part, can observe, maybe improve their instruments, their implants, which is not possible in the operating room. I think it should be absolutely an, a mandatory part in the, in the program of orthopedic and trauma residences. So you really don't want to do the fractures in the middle of the night at 2 o'clock the first time. It's uh, like in reality, so it's a good thing. This is the, the most developed course format I personally know. This is the tightest relation to realistic situation I know. This is a course that should be implemented in each training of our residents.